All right, guys, in this video, I want to talk about something a little different. Some of the art teachers and influences that I had over the years. Well, of course, I went to um, SJHS, so I, um, I had Mr. Cooper, Mr. Dennis Cooper. But sadly, although he was an amazing teacher and all that stuff, um, I have no idea what happened to him because I left Italy a long, long, long time ago. And uh, although I kept in touch with the school as much as I could, um, I don't know. If you if you look, he has no social media of all of any kind whatsoever. So if you look at, because um, <clears throat> he he worked in fashion, he made the most amazing fashion drawings. But he also could paint just about anything and produce just about anything in clay too. So yeah, he was uh, he was an amazing teacher and all. So, uh, but I, I have no way of finding him, so I can't show a picture of him or anything, because I just don't have anything. It'd be cool if if I could find something. Anyway, anyway, um, right here you have David Byers Brown, and there's plenty of things you can find on him, because uh, he worked on. Um, who framed Roger Rabbit, and um, he taught me how to do a bunch of fun stuff, including 3D model, and uh, we did animation in his class, and it was really fun stuff. Anyway, he was great with a pencil and the paintbrush, just as much as he was on the computer. And uh, yeah, he really paved the way for a lot of the stuff that you've seen on my channel. And a lot of the stuff that was on my previous channel that I deleted because, well, well, the art industry is what it is. So, anyway, that's a rant for another day. Let's talk about, let's talk about David Byers Brown. Uh, he had an amazing course. I'm not sure if he's still teaching. I hope he is, because um, he was just so good at. It. Anyway, patient guy, great artist, and I want to show you guys some of his work here um, and it's very um, very strange in a way but it's also very well put together you can see you can tell by the strokes of his work that he's um, a very capable artist you can tell that um, the bone structures and overall positioning of the characters are very fluid and creative and full of expression. Uh, he could do things such as Disney characters over there. So he could, he had a really uh, incredible range of capabilities from things like that all the way to other kinds of artwork such as this in color, so painting. And I think um, that his work was just really masterful. And so, yeah, just wanted to sh share this with you guys. I would love in, um, to hear your thoughts on my art teacher. Well, just generally his, his work and uh, what you think. It's just very appealing in its own way, although very unique, I would say, because it's the, I haven't seen many people who would... Um, Put someone, you know, like the <laughs> characters from Walt Disney just showing up there and then going into more of like Greek figures and, um, you know, they, they don't kind of fit in the same kind of world if you catch my drift. Anyway, anyway, that was my little critique here or more of just showing you some of the stuff that he did, and he did some amazing stuff, like, you know, in the movies too. Who Framed Roger Rabbit? He worked on that, and many more things. But anyway, thanks for watching. It's a big shout out to him, and um, anybody who wants to make their own duet video would be great. Of course, Ryan, if you feel like doing it, just go ahead. Ryan Freeman, and if you haven't seen his channel, you should go take a look. And I'll see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.